YouTube. Today I'm going to teach you how to tie a full Windsor knotted tie. You can buy a tie at any store that sells suits and even more places. Once you've bought, bought the tie, just look at my video and you will learn how to tie it. To start off, you put it around your neck with the skinny side on your left and the bulky side on your right. The skinny side should be a little lower or a little more upper than your waist. My waist would be right here, so it's a little more up. The other side should just hang long and it should be like that. After you've done so, you've done so wrap the big side, the bulkier side over and under your neck hole. Then it should look like this. You have this short end and the bulky end. After that, you throw it under to the other side, not through the neck hole, until you get to the other side and throw it over again through the neck hole. It should then look like this. You're probably thinking, why does it have why does it look like it's backwards? Well, you're gonna have to cover it up. That's just how you want the tie to be formed. So to continue on from that, you get the big bulky side, wrap it over and under your neck hole. Then there should be this little pocket. You put it through that pocket. And it should look like that. You're not finished yet. You pull up the big fat part of the tie. Then you pull this up. onto your neck. This bottom piece right here, you pull, you pull it down to make it tighter, to make the tie go tighter. It's connected. It should then look like this. There's your completed tie. Sorry, I am not wearing a collared shirt. And the back look like looks like this. And you just put it through your little holes. If you don't have that, then you just get a tie clip and you're set. Thank you for watching how to do a full Windsor knotted tie. Bye bye and I hope you learned how to do the correct way of a full